What's up, everybody? Welcome to another edition of Real Spit from a Gangster Gone Legit. It's your boy Paris, a.k.a. Hakeem, Gangster Gone Legit, GGL. Today, I want to talk about reaching the fifth floor. What's up, everybody? Um, today is my 50th birthday. And I wanted to do a video because um, I wanted to let pretty much the world know um, how grateful I am to see another year, especially this birthday. Because this is a milestone. Um, it's, it's, it's a bittersweet feeling. Um, and I say that because to finally hit 50 years old, man, that's half a century. And a lot of people that I grew up with, unfortunately, didn't get a chance to see this age. Um, this is, I made it to the fifth floor. And that in itself is a is is something to really be grateful for. Um, a lot of my brothers, a lot of my friends, they didn't see past the second floor. Floors meaning your your where you're at in age. So second floor is your twenties, third floor your thirties, fourth floor your forties, and fifth floor the fifties. I just hit that and it's a it's a hell of a feeling because I was told I wasn't going to live past 18 and I believed it just like a lot of you brothers out there do but I'm living proof that no matter what you've been through what you did in the streets you can change your life and you can be rewarded with life. And I believe that's what I want this message to really be about. I want my young brothers out here to want to live to see 50 years old, 60 years old, want to live to be old. Start changing the narrative, man. Start changing how they feel like I, I know firsthand what these young brothers think and, and, and how they feel and, and ready to die and and they they don't have no regards for life I was that person in my teens my young 20s even 30s didn't care if I lived to die um Felt like it was inevitable, it was going to happen anyway. You know, but what I come to realize is this life that we're given is a blessing. And we need to accept it as such and embrace it and want to start living. Stop hating ourselves so much that we join these gangs or we deal in self-defeating behaviors such as putting drugs in our body, excessive alcohol, stuff like that, um, knowing the outcome. I got to say that Hitting 50 years old is a new chapter. This is a turning point for my life. It's almost as, as if the drive that I had when I was in my early 20s and I wanted to be successful and I wanted to, you know, uh, conquer pretty much the world and anything that I did, I wanted to take over and do the best that I could do. Well. That's the that's where I'm at now. 
now it's about at this in this chapter 50 chapter 50 let's call it um now i want to make sure my family's straight um my kids future it's about them building for them um being able to be here at this age is a blessing and i'm not gonna accept it as as nothing less um, that's definitely what it is and i'm going to um, acknowledge that I, I want i really want my younger brothers to listen to this because it saddens me that a lot of brothers every single day all over, all over the country um, they, they're going to die tonight they're going to die tomorrow uh, and it's because of choices they made uh, we have to start changing these, these, these choices we make and decisions and we have to think for the future we have to think to see 50 years old we have to think to see 60, 70 um, life doesn't have to be over 18, 19, 20, 21. We got to start doing better, y'all. I feel good, man. I still feel young. Um, lost a lot of weight. I've changed how I eat. I, I, I still feel young myself. You know, I feel young. But what really makes me feel good about hitting this, this age today is the fact that my thinking has completely changed. Um, I've matured a lot. And it, it, it definitely takes a, a lot to change, you know, circumstances and how you're used to coming up and how you're used to living. It takes a lot, but I've, I've done it and, I, and I'm, I'm happy to say that you can do this too. You just gotta be sick and tired of being sick and tired. Bottom line, and wanna live. Um, we have to start accepting that getting old is okay. It's not a bad thing. I wanna see my brothers start living longer. I wanna see you guys it really, it really bothers me to see how many of us are dying every day um, and that we really don't give a fuck. Like, life means nothing. Um, taking a life means nothing. And our own life means nothing. Even though today's my birthday, I felt the, ne the need to do this video and, and share this message in hopes that somebody out there hears it and, and realizes that the way they're thinking today, that, that, that dumb thinking that, you know, they got to ride for their hood or their gang or rep their color, whatever it is. Man, I just hope for the best gift I could get on my birthday is that a brother hears what I'm saying and says, man, I want to live. I'm tired of this gang shit. I'm tired of this lifestyle. I'm tired of doing these drugs. Um, I'm just, I just want a new life. And I want it now. That man, that'd be the best gift I could have, man, to see one of you young brothers inbox me. Or even if you don't inbox me, just inbox another brother and tell them that you love them enough that you want to see them change and you want to see them stop shooting each other and stop riding for the hood 
um, learn to love themselves, change the fact that dying is cool and stop putting out there that living is living is what's really cool because our, our children need us to live our mothers need us our families need us uh, as men we have to start doing better black lives will never matter as long as they don't matter to us. And I say that because as long as we keep killing each other, no one's ever gonna take us serious. No one's ever gonna respect us because we don't respect ourselves. We don't respect our own lives. We don't love ourselves. Man, um, this could be the best birthday of my life, man. If one brother out there will get this message and just say enough is enough, and they want change. Well, like I said, I hope I reach you. If you're watching this, please know that getting old is definitely a way to go out.